Hello. Today, I'm here with, oh, the one fell down. This box that my sister gave me for my birthday, it's got a keyhole, but no key. And I've also got this thing, which I think would be useful at some point, but um, I have decided to put in here my rock collection, these seashell, sea, um, glasses, uh, were a part of the gift for my sister. And then the rest of these stones I have gotten other ways. And I figured this one counted as a stone, even though it's been mounted. This one's been shined up. This one's been shined up. This one's been tumbled. It's a um, smoky quartz. I think it's very nice for like this kind of a thing because it's like a different texture and different parts. And then this is a pendulum. Like it's got a knot, but I think it's labradorite. I love labradorite. And then this one's just quartz. And then this one is a jasper that I just got yesterday. And I think it's wonderful. It's like got cities in it. It's purple and yellow. I love it. And this one's a tiger's eye thumb kind of stone. This one looks like a heart and it's yellow. And I got it at a Harkness, I think. And then this one isn't really a stone, but it's pretending to be. It's got a little cross in it. And this one is Dalmatian Jasper, which I've heard is good for depression and that kind of thing. So I have that one. And that's my collection so far. I decided that I was going to introduce these glass pieces one at a time so that I would really look at each one instead of just dumping them in. So I made a promise to them that I would look at each one and put them in one at a time. But I kind of want to just put them all in. That one's cool. It looks like a state. It looks like Tennessee or something. Um, looks like a hat. I'm thinking about using this as like a um, like a bone throwing set that uh, you could like maybe take them and then put them in and then how they lay in here is your reading or something. So I thought that might be nice to experiment with. But I think the first step is to get to know your pieces because usually people have bone throwing sets for a really long time and they intricately know all the pieces. So, I guess this is what I'm gonna do right now. I wonder how she got these pieces of sea glass. I didn't ask and I realized I didn't ask. But I'm interested if she like found them or if she got them all at once. Or if she like found them on beaches. That's a very special gift. I feel like I didn't appreciate it enough. I did appreciate it. I was very happy to get it because I love sea glass. But I didn't even think about like, wait a minute, did he she collect each of these sea glasses? That's very special. <clears throat> That's like an arrowhead. I feel like I should say each one is like something so that I'll remember that there's something like that in there. Well, it looks like a shell. This one looks like a, potato, a tortilla chip. The 
this one. It's like an orange slice. That one's very small. Oh, that one's very pleasantly small. Very nice. <clears throat> this one looks like a dinosaur. It's got a little cutout area. This one looks like Florida. This one looks like a Star Trek badge. <clears throat> this one looks like Utah. This one's also very pleasantly light and thin. And it looks like a state too, but I don't remember which one that is. There's one that looks like that. Maybe it's Virginia. I think Virginia looks like that. This one's nice and small. It's a little ghost. A little small ghost. This one's small. It's a... Makes me think of a min. Uh, this one's got cool little feet around the edges. It looks like an animal. A little raccoon. This one is the bluest one I think I've seen. Pointy. It looks like a hand pointing. That'll be cool in a reading at some point to have a pointing hand. This one's very small and thin. All the little ones are in the bottom. That one looks like a little pointed foot. That one looks like a little moon. This one. Little triangle. This is very tiny. The last one. It's a little tooth. All right. Maybe we could like close the box and shake it around, and that could be how you do the reading. I could have ways of what things mean in corners, maybe because of the elements. And I could have meanings for the different rocks on top of what they already have. I could assign them meanings. I think that's a nice, I could add more to it. I think there could be more, but I think it's a nice thing. Let's see if there's any of those ones that I recognize. There's the Tennessee one. So you can't see all of the sea glass at the same time, probably. Some of it. This is an interesting amount of stuff, I think, for a reading box. So maybe we'll do that in the future. Maybe that'll be something I learned how to do better. I thought this thing would be nice for sorting stuff. I had the idea of sorting the wealth in the kingdom of like my um my spirit garden kingdom and I wondered if I could redistribute the wealth just because my kingdom is kind of all of my spell work that's um, the kind of thing that it's like something representing something else. I think that's mostly what spells are, is like doing something that represents something else, kind of to show the energy that you're talking about, kind of trying to engender the energy. And so if you like act it out in a certain way, it like helps open up that energy to you. 
I think. I think I, I think that that's how it works. So that's how I think about it, at least most of the time. But I was thinking about, so, you know, my kingdom, I've like kind of spent a lot of time on it. And so it's like, it's got spells about a bunch of different stuff, but I think it's everything that I care about and I care about the rescue redistribution of wealth. And so I feel like maybe some kind of sectioning out to the different quarters things that make sense for them to have but like so that it's kind of even you can see what others have so that's my idea also for later I just left this up here because I wanted to remember to do something with it but I just also thought it would be like a nice thing like if I took something like this basket And I, I wonder if you can see that. Yes, you can sort of see it. If I wanted to show you, for example, what's in here, I could put it in here and that might be good. This is empty, the little box. So I'm kind of thinking about the elements um, and having them arranged like the world card so that this one is spades and this one is hearts and this one is diamonds and this one is clubs. So my pegasus, I think that can be here. And then... This is a special rock to me. Maybe I should put it with my other rocks. It's an amethyst. I think it's very beautiful. You can't really see it in this light very well. Put it in the rock box. This is not even the star anymore. But in an earlier video, there was a yellow, yellow star, and I used to have it attached to this cupcake, and I didn't know it wasn't in here, honestly. I thought it was still in there. I don't know where it is. It's kind of important. Oh, the special string is in here. You get to see the special string. There it is. It's very special. Who gets the special string? I think it has money on it. So that to me says diamonds gets the special string. This is a little assemblage um, about the lion. Lion's clearly a club's thing. Oh, it's good that I'm going into this because there's some stuff that got knocked in here. All right, so this is the plan card. And I don't know, it might be the only one at this point. So this is the plan. What is in here with this? Can I show this to you? Oh, natural beauty is the plan. How nice. Natural beauty was a 
flavor union that I tried to start without actually meaning to. Alright, so the plan is that. Great. Let's see. We've got the grandmother pig thing here. It's got some, it's got a grandmother pig in there. And I think that that's a heart thing. It's also the right node, and this is the left node. Right node, left node. Right, great. Okay, so this is already in the right places nicely. <clears throat> now, there's some more stuff in here. This is a box that I really like. This is a seed. This is a seed. These are both seeds. I'm gonna put this one in here. That'll be great. Good place for a seed. And this looks like some special money. 20 pence. I'm gonna put that in there with a plan. Here's our decision. We'll put that with the plan. Okay, we'll put some Palo Santo match. And we've got some stickers that are to do hearts and buy. That can go in with the plan. And we've got some party cowboy boots. Go in with the plan. Forever pin. And that can go with the plan. This looks like private information. What is this? That's a spell. So um I guess I'll put it in there. Sure. And can we fit a Buddha just for good tidings? And can we fit a flower? <gasps> okay. And let's try to get these confettis in here. And great, that's a nice little thing now. I see a turkey down there, I'm gonna get it. There. There, a much better plan, I think. I think the plan has been revamped. That's good. I think the plan we keep in our hearts. Maybe we keep the plan in the thoughts. <clears throat> we can have the plan. Okay. All right. Now, this one, does this screw off? There's a little seed in there. I'm gonna give that there. Now, I've got this. Embroidery. I think Luca did this. It's very nice. And then it's got this prism of diamonds. Got this little pig. In spades. Got some spare strings. And I don't think that's wealth. I think that that's like stuff to 
make stuff out of supplies or something. I'm gonna put that there. And then I think that the pig. I don't think people go in there. Pig can have a nice little spot to stand there. This is a best of 2022 cupcake topper that this basket received. I think six assemblages received it this year. So that's theirs. Um, maybe I'll stick it with the lion. There we go. Oh, they actually have a spoon. So that's always nice. All right. Then we've got the spider thing. That's infrastructure. All right, so I'll put the box back in. Okay, now I think first the special strip. Wait. I mean, I think it just looks pretty evenly dispersed. I think we've looked at it. So I'm just going to put it back. Okay, special string in the bottom. Make a nice little nest. technical difficulties. All right, so, okay, lion, there, this is the right, left. Proceed. Other seed. Blade. Signal. I think this bird might want to move out of here. I don't know. Maybe it's up here. That's fine. The angel should be on this side. And this came out of the thing. Okay. Now, a little bit of stuff from Luca's present. 
for a sparkle. That's our thing. So that was meandering, but thanks for watching. And I think that was a little improvement, a little bit of clarity. And I hope you have a nice day. Okay, bye-bye.